something bad happened. Something really bad happened. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Mike Dolce Knows channel. A different setup today, and I actually like this because we're going to chat. I'm in my my chatting chair. It's, it's a smoking chair, as they say, but I don't smoke. Therefore, we're going to talk. Now, I'm trying to update the channel for you guys, and I really appreciate all the feedback that we've gotten. You've noticed that we've well, maybe you haven't noticed, we've crushed all the analytics. We have broken the code within YouTube and our channel is now able to be monetized. We've gotten more features and functions that are available to us and that's awesome. And that was the goal. So thank you each and every one of you for being here. I appreciate this just greatly. Now this channel is for you. And with that, I want to know what you want to know. What do you want to know? What do you want me to do? There's so many great channels out there that do such a good job. And I don't want to do the same thing everyone else does unless you want me to do that. In many ways, I've kind of like I hidden away from this stuff, the MMA stuff. I don't really talk about MMA that much. I really want to talk about fitness and health. I want you to live longer, better. But at the same time, those type of channels just don't seem to do well when we speak like I do. And that's honestly, I don't give you clickbait topics. I don't come up with, with fake drama. I don't do any of that stuff. And our channel has always suffered from a subscribership, from views, engagement, from reach. We never busted through a lot of those thresholds that other channels have done, and kudos to them, because they do use a lot of the drama. They do a lot of the stuff that we just don't do here. The one thing I can do, probably better than almost anyone else, is I can comment directly on combat sports, on mixed martial arts, on fighting. Now, I can bring you a lot more MMA and combat-related news and insights behind the scenes. I mean, I could do that all day long. Most of my conversations in my personal life are with fighters and coaches and promoters. I mean, that just those are my friends. I mean, shit, look at my clothes I'm, I'm accidentally wearing. Everything I'm wearing is pretty much fighting related. I mean, even these these Reebok Nanos, old schools, were given to me when Robbie Lawler fought Johnny Hendricks for the world title that we won. Johnny beat Robbie for that fight. Now I got these Reebok Nanos as a sponsorship from Reebok. Reebok actually sponsored myself and the brand for quite a period of time. Point is, do you want me to start talking more about MMA? Should I start covering the MMA more like a news channel, which I'm happy to do. I just didn't know if that's what you wanted to see. So help us, trust me. You cannot stop me from talking about fat loss and improving personal fitness and extending life through evidence-based scientific practices. I'm gonna talk about that all the time for sure, but maybe I should embrace my MMA relationship. I mean, I am the four-time World MMA Trainer of the Year, the only trainer to ever win that award four times. I'm in the New Jersey Martial Arts Hall of Fame for my contribution in the realm of nutrition and weight management in the sport of MMA, right? I'm the creator of UFC Fit, the only diet and exercise program ever endorsed by the UFC. I'm the only coach with a 100% success ratio working with the world's greatest athletes in regards to weight management, weight cutting, and performance. I wrote a number one best-selling book on weight cutting called Three Weeks to Shred It, and you can just see, I mean, just some of the athletes behind me. So, that being said, should I start covering more MMA-specific content? Would you like to see more MMA-specific content? And if so, this is you, 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 my great friends. You get to dictate the future of this channel by telling me what type of content do you want to see. Leave it in the comments below. Do you want to see something more like Ariel Hawani's MMA Hour? Do you want to see something more like Luke Thomas's Morning Combat? Do you want to see something more like my buddy 
Nick Tregioli's bodybuilding and bullshit who does an amazing job. He's just shooting through the YouTube algorithm speaking specifically about bodybuilding. Should I do that about MMA? Would you like to see that? Who else? Nick Strength and Power does more of just like, uh, no disrespect to Nick, but he basically just regurgitates what people are posting on their Instagram pages. I mean, do you want to see that? Or maybe Dave Palumbo over at RX Muscle. What Again, that's more in the bodybuilding side. It shows you. I don't even pay attention to a lot of the, the MMA content because I know it all. Like, I know, it's funny. I know more about what's going on in MMA than all that ESPN does. Then a lot of the news shows, I know the fights before they're booked because I get coaches calling me, Dolce, do you think so-and-so can make this weight class at this time? What do you think about so-and-so? Is How's his weight cut going to be? Is he going to be able to make weight to fight us in this period of time? I get these big name fighters. I get all this all the time. I get <laughs> so much great insight. What do you want to see? Please leave it in the comments below. I want to see, I want to see a hundred different comments from every single person who watches this. What do you want to see in every single person who gives me insight? I will build that into this channel because I'm wide open here. I'm literally wide open. I can build anything. I can speak about anything. We, we have the ability to go as deep as you want. I just didn't know. I, I always felt like the MMA commentary was crowded. But maybe you want to hear what I have to say. You know, I can always bring on special guests, good friends, and things such as that. We can do a little bit more of like a newsy show. Or maybe like a Fuad Abiyad's bro chats. Maybe you want me to do something like that in the MMA side. But tell me, what do you want to see? And tell me, who does it well? Give kudos. Do you like the Greg Doucette style of like, boom, screaming in the camera and just super amped up, whether he's right or wrong? Like, he's got the passion. He's got the fires. Do you want to see something like that? If so, what? Please let me know. Or more of like a scientific breakdown, like a Leo with longevity does, or like Derek over more plates, more dates. Do you want to see something along those lines? Or like a Jeff Nippert, I think he does well in that category also. Or like an Athlean X, you know, exercise breakdown. I mean, I have a great facility here, awesome studio. I mean, you've, you've seen different glimpses and different setups. I'm in the, the same facility that, that you see me all the time. We got all sorts of cool stuff here. We do have the smoking chair, by the way. So let me know, what do you think? What do you want to see? Comments below. I want to see at least 100 comments on this. I, I, I need, I need, I need, I need, I need, I need your feedback. This is not my channel. This channel is not for me. This channel is 100% for you. So if you could just take 30 seconds, boom, leave a comment below. Let me know what do you want to see and give me a lookbook of who does it well. Dolce, I think you should do this just like this channel does with this spin on it. Oh my God, I would absolutely freaking lutely love that. So I think that's it. That's it. I'm just checking back in. Now, where have I been? You, you might have noticed I've been gone for a little bit. I'm going to come back. There's oh, something, something bad happened. Something really bad happened. Um, and I'm not going to get into that here in this video. I will get into that um, next week. All right. I, I needed I needed some time. I needed some separation. But I'll break down next week exactly what happened last week and where I've been and why I've been unable to uh, to post and, and do any of these videos here. I appreciate you. If you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing to this channel. Grow with this channel. Be a part of this with us. I would greatly appreciate that. I appreciate your time, and I always want to make sure I'm I'm over delivering to you. So leave your comments below and be a part of this channel. Let your voice be heard. What do you want to hear? Who do you want to see? How do you want me to present? What information do you want to know? And uh, that's it. I appreciate you. Until next time, boom!